9 raised to power x minus 6 raised to power s is equal to 4 raised to power s. What is the value of x? Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of s from this given nice Olympiad exponential problem. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Solution. Then this is 9 raised to the power s minus 6 raised to the power s is equal to 4 raised to the power s. Let's divide all through by 4 raised to the power x. At this, we have 9 raised to the power x divided by 4 raised to the power s minus 6 raised to the power x divided by 4 raised to the power s is equal to 4 raised to the power s divided by 4 raised to the power x. Then this one will cancel this one. We have 9 raised to the power x divided by 4 raised to the power x minus 6 raised to the power s divided by 4 raised to the power s is equal to 1. Then, then this is 9 raised to the power s over 4 raised to the power s minus 2 here, 2, 2 here, 3. We have 3 raised to the power s over 2 raised to the power s is equal to 1. Then 9 raised to the power s can be written as 3 square raised to the power s over 4 raised to the power s can be written as 2 square raised to the power s minus 3 raised to the power s over 2 raised to the power s is equal to 1. Take note of this rule that if you have a raised to the power n raised to the power m, this is equal to a raised to the power m raised to the power n. Also, if you have a raised to the power n over b raised to the power n, this is equal to a over b all raised to the power n. So from here we have 3 square over 2 square all raised to the power x minus 3 over 2 all raised to the power s is equal to 1. Then from this rule we have 3 over 2 all raised to the power s all square minus 3 over 2 all raised to the power of s is equal to 1. Now let 3 over 2 raised to the power of s is equal to t. Then we have t square minus t is equal to 1. t square minus t minus 1 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. And our quadratic general formula in this form is giving us t is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then from the equation, a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 1, c is equal to minus 1. Now we have t is equal to minus bracket minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by minus 1 over 2 multiplied by 1. So this is t is equal to minus times minus 1 plus 1 plus or minus 
square root of minus 1 square, 1, then minus 4 times 1 times minus 1, that is plus 4 over 2. Now t is equal to 1 plus or minus square root of 5 over 2. Then t is equal to 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 or t is equal to 1 minus square root of 5 over 2. But 3 over 2 raised to the power s is equal to t. Then we have 3 over 2 raised to the power s is equal to 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 or yeah, 3 over 2 raised to the power s is equal to 1 minus square root of 5 over 2. But if you look at this, this is positive and this is negative. So the whole of this equation is less than zero. Therefore, this is rejected. The only resolution we have is 3 over 2 raised to the power s is equal to 1 plus square root of 5 over 2. This is the only resolution we have. Now let's take the log of both sides. Log 3 over 2 raised to the power s is equal to log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then this is s log 3 over 2 is equal to log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Now let's divide both sides by log 3 over 2 divided by log 3 over 2 divided by log 3 over 2. This one will cancel this. We have x is equal to log 1 plus root 5 over 2 divided by log 3 over 2. Take note of this rule that if you have log a over b, this is equal to log a minus log b. So, and this become s is equal to log 1 plus root 5 minus log 2 divided by log 3 minus log 2. Then s is equal to log 3.2 Three six minus log two over log three minus log two, then log three is equal to zero point four seven seven one, and log two is equal to zero point. 3, 0, 1, 0. Now let's substitute. S is equal to log 3.236 is 0 0.5100 0, 0 minus, then we have log 2 is 0 0.3010 0, divided by log 3 is 0. 
4771 minus log 2 is 0 0.3010 then s is equal to 0 0.209 divided by 0 0.1761 then s is equal to 1.1 eight six eight and this is the final answer we can check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong let's check we have the given equation nine raised to power s minus six raised to power s is equal to four raised to power x now let's work with this when x is equal to one point one eight six eight then four is to power s is equal to four is to power one point one eight six eight then this is equal to five point two then let's work with this again we have nine raised to power s minus six raised to power s this is equal to 9 raised to the power 1.1868 minus 6 raised to the power 1.1868 must be equal to 5.2. Then 9 raised to the power 1.1868. This is 13. Point five six seven minus six raised to the power one point one eight six eight this is eight point three eighty five now let's subtract the truth if you subtract this from this we have five point two which is equal to five point two we satisfy the given equation at s is equal to 1.1868 if you enjoyed the class please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe thank you